guys always seem to get sick like when you have so much stuff to do the next day because me right now what's up guys it's courtney and today we're testing out this ginormous stress ball orby stress ball thingy majiggy that i've been seeing all around youtube i thought it'd be really fun to test it out see how well it worked and it just looked really fun to play with to be honest please don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already to stay up to date with all my new videos and we're so close to 300,000 subscribers so please help me get there now let's get started testing out this diy Okay, so first up, I plugged my sink, filled it up with water, and then I started dumping 20,000 Orbeez, or fake Orbeez, because you know your girl didn't pay for the real ones, into my sink, and I got those off Amazon, so I will link them down below. Oh my goodness, my whole sink is full. I think it already absorbed the rest of the water I just put in there. This one has a little bit more water over here. Let's just add a little more over here. Andy is obsessed with these, so he wanted to come help me with this DIY. So this literally feels so cool. We went to dinner and I thought they were done expanding and then we came back and they were even bigger. So I got this giant clear-ish. Clear is never actually clear. It's like this yellowish color until you fill it up. And I got this off of Amazon. It's a three foot balloon. So we're gonna blow it up first so we have some space to add the Orbeez. So this is what I have right now. Let me back up. My slobber is on the inside of this balloon. That's disgusting. Thank goodness. I don't... <laughs> Do you see that? Oh no, it's just the outside getting hands are wet. Oh, okay. This stains it. So I'm taking this water jug and filling it up with all the Orbeez. And this is very, very time consuming. This whole process probably took about 30 minutes to do. And then I'm draining all the water out of it. And then I'm putting the top of the balloon on the bottle, if that makes sense. And then I'm holding the bottle up in the air and letting the Orbeez fall into the balloon. And then just repeating this over and over and over until the ball was full. And then eventually we had to move it onto the counter because the sink wasn't big enough to hold the balloon and the Orbeez in it. And it was getting very heavy too. So just keep going until it's completely as big as you want. When I was done, I just tied the balloon in a knot and then Andy and I basically fought over who was playing with it first. Put your other arm underneath it. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's falling! I can't get this. It feels like it burst this off. is so heavy! Okay, I can't hold it anymore! <laughs> uh, I look dead and my back hurts now, but that was a successful DIY. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what DIY you want to see me test out next in the comments down below. If you missed my last videos, you could just click on the side of me or the eye up in the corner, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.